Uh, upgrade. Let me let me upgrade myself. Okay. I kind of want to follow the Mayfield story here. At the same time, I want to follow Rook's. Hmm. I'm going to take Rook's story first. We'll come back to Mayfield. Let's not have all the same. Okay. Tracker's operational. It's in a building we know belong to Intex, so if this is real, it could be big. Okay, so what am I doing there? Get the prototype back so they don't have time to realize it's fake, and take anything else in that room that looks interesting. It's likely to be with their most sensitive stuff. Okay. Optional objective, check any laptops. Hmm. That should be interesting. Okay, so. There's our target. Targets. Protected by a professional, which you can tell by his silhouette. Um, and the way he's standing, mainly. Now. This mission is a bit more tricky. Now, she said nothing about not hurting people. So let's get this door open. We can knock out that guard and take out the one above him. And then we can get up here after wirejacking and mess around a bit. So, well, if I'm gonna do it, may as well finish the job. Why is it? It only told me now it only takes some punches to knock them out. Maybe I wanted to kill him. Seriously, game. Hmm, yeah, it says down here. Maybe I want to kill them, game. Maybe I'm a violent person. Okay. Uh, let's have this camera open that door. And that guy's standing close enough to it that I think it'll knock him out when it opens. Open door policy. I like it. Okay. Now, that guy is standing right in front of a door, and he has line of sight out the whole way, so I don't want to do that right now. Let's turn off his light so he starts wandering. And then let's open his door again. Up there. We can take him out when he turns around. Okay. Wirejack. Oh shit. That ain't good. Oh, that is not good. Okay. Um. Shit. Uh. Da, da, da. Okay, we just need to get out of here. Ooh, I thought that guy was about to shoot me. So let's wait until he turns around and let's get out of this room. Okay. Now we need this professional to turn around. So let's call the elevator turns to face it, we open the door behind him, and we really flashly take him out. Okay, wire jack, not that there's much need for it, but whatever. Uh, last laptop is up there, so I'm going to need to get back to that motion detector to take out that enforcer, or I can just Actually, let's not break the windows. Okay. That's that laptop taken. Optional objectives complete. Let's get back out of here. Whee. And exit with style. <laughs> oh jeez, that is not so stylish. I'm impressed though, that guy has a very quick draw and good aim. Very impressed. Wow, that was terrible. <laughs> okay, exit with style take two. Okay, brutal ghost ninja. Awesome. I would have preferred, you know, psychopath, which is what you get when you kill everyone on level, but whatever. Okay, what did you find? I got the fake prototype, something else, where'd you want it? Usual dead drop. Okay. Go fuck yourself. Alright, well, whatever. 
I'm basically working for Rook anyway. And maybe some time, alright, whatever that means. Uh, I'm actually, I'm going to just go back to this level here, and I'm going to kill everyone just so I can get the Psychopath um, title or trait or whatever. I'm assuming there's an achievement for it, so I may as well do it now. Um, let's just have that open that door. Uh, like that. Hackety, and there we go. I think that's all you need for the Psychopath achievement. Yep, Psychopath. Sweet. Okay. Gessler, go fuck yourself. Pay zero dollars. Sounds like an interesting mission. Let's do it. Seriously, grow a fucking dick and shove it up your ass, asshole. Alright, that's nice of you. Okay, so, we're back with the Chief of Police. He wants us to break into his HQ. That sounds like an interesting mission. I've discovered evidence that Selena Delgado's post-mortem was altered after Katie Collins was arrested. What I don't know is why. Are my men covering for one of their own, or just changing the facts to fit the easiest suspect to convict? Well, what, what do you want me to do about it? I'm not one of your men. If you can get to the coroner's computer in our HQ, you might be able to find an autosave of the original somewhere on there. If we can see what the difference is, it might confirm whether this is corruption or just laziness. Okay. I'm assuming the reason he can't get it is the same reason he can't do anything else, because then he would get killed, and yeah. Okay. So we need to get into there. And to get into there, we need to get the blue wiretap. And to get the blue wiretap, it's probably much easier if we get the green wiretap as well. So what we're going to start with here is I'm going to make my way in. That glass is already broken, so I'm going to make my way in through there. Wait for him to turn around. Uh, I can't really get any access to anything from here, can I? Uh, no, I can take that guy out, but this is Gessler. Or not Gessler, this is the police chief, so he wants minimum violence. Let's land in here. Now. I want to get access to that guy. Hmm, actually no, I think that that may not be the best way to do it. Um, that's not the best way to do it either. Hmm, I'm considering I can jump high enough that I can actually smash through that window from the ground floor, but... I don't know. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do it that way. I'm gonna go back to the other side. And smash through that window from the ground floor. Which will give us direct access to the floor that that guy is on. Let's get down there. Uh, there. Nope. See, this is a lot easier when you're not playing in 720p. case I can actually see the window and I actually have a feeling I can't jump with enough power to break it. No, I can't. Okay. Um, so let's have a better look at what we're doing here. What I really need access to is that blue one there. So I suppose if I do this... That might work. Oh yeah, it turns out that light as well. That's interesting. can turn that light back on, so that's not really going to help me much. Uh, drop down, wire jack, let's just make our way out here. Unfortunately, because that window's open now, he can see all the way to, like, down here. So I'm going to need to keep away from the building now. Hmm. Now, I have access to the blue, which is all I actually need to get access to the final objective here. So, let's... I'm going to get back in here. I'm going to use the sound detectors to get access to that thing. So, what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to get that elevator and take it down to that level. So, when I get to this level, I want the lights to turn off and that door to open. Uh -huh. 
And when I get to that level, I don't really need anything to happen because I can't take that guy out. Even the power sockets count for lethal, or not for lethal, for violence. So I'm not going to do that either. Now, let's get back down here. Let's take the elevator. And let's go down. And down again. That'll alert that guy. Oh, shit. Okay, well that's okay, we still got this light switch here. Ah, fuck. Um, okay, let's get that light switch here. Oh, shit. I do that every time. Okay. Now he walks past. We activate the light switch. He walks... Ah, damn it. We need to activate it faster. Okay. Damn it. Okay, well I need to go back then. Luckily these guys are totally... Oh, shit. <laughs> wow, I didn't even realize that could happen. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna have to load an older save game. Uh, that one. Hmm. I'm gonna do... Oh, shit. Damn it! I thought I'd gotten out of the elevator already. Once he's going... Now once he goes the other way, I'm going to open this. That'll let me get down here, and hopefully that'll close before he gets there. Excellent. Okay. Now, I can remotely control things. Okay, good. I'm going to call the lift up to there. And when the lift gets back down, by virtue of this camera, that door will activate that. And this looks like a total mess, but I'm going to quickly explain what it does. I'm going to go up and press that button, and that will call the lift back up to this floor. When it gets there, nothing will happen. It'll come back down, however. And when it gets there, this sound detector will go off and open that vault door. And uh, it'll come back down here because I step into this camera. And when it comes back down, it, that'll open the other door. So basically, these two doors should open at exactly the same time. That's what I'm hoping. So let it get there, and now it comes back down. Both the doors open, I come in here. Doors will close behind me, but they've set it up so that you can get back out, so that's fine. That door opens, this switch opens that door. And now the only problem here is getting back out, which isn't a problem at all. Connect that switch there, and you're golden. I just need to make our way back out for the other side. We've gotten all the objectives and optional objectives. Exit with style. Gentleman, ghost, thoughtful. That's hardly surprising. Continue. Did you find your original obituary? Fresh from the recycle bin. Not dealing with a clever cop. Superb. Oh wow, she was shot three times, not one, and the second two shots were point black rain... Point black? Yes, point black. Point blank range, seconds after she hit the ground. Whoever killed Selena Delgado, they dropped out of a third story window to make sure she was dead. Whether dealing with a professional operative or more than one shooter. Either way, this suggests Katie Collins is innocent. So, can we re release it? Yes, but not yet. Enough to get every dirty cop in this town arrested the moment I go public with this, or I'll disappear under cir suspicious circumstances. I can handle that side of it, but I'll get in touch if we find any more about our killer. Thanks, Conway. Okay. We've maxed out these upgrades. I am going to buy... I'm going to buy the long shot. Okay, here we go. And that's just so I have something to put my upgrade points into. I'm not actually going to use it, don't worry about that. Um, and you'll see, I won't connect anything to guns, because that's what the long shot does. Okay, I have a suspect for the Selena Delgado murder. I need you to get into his apartment and look for a piece of evidence that might confirm it. Okay. Okay, I think I've got something. Which is what, if you'd like to tell me. Postmortem you retrieved showed that Selena was shot again, point blank, with the same weapon right after hitting the ground, which suggests our killer threw himself out of a third story window 
to make sure she was dead. Okay, well, we've heard this already. Can't fault him for enthusiasm. And it's true. I mean, if you jump out of the window, I mean... Okay, that means he had tech. I'm guessing a drop shot trench coat, but who knows what else. So I tracked some shipments from TX Fabrications, who make that stuff, and it turned up an address right across the street from the crime scene. That's my address, but I definitely didn't kill her. Yeah, that's interesting. I want you to check it out, look for any evidence of what kit this might, guy might have, and anything else suspicious. Up for it? Always. We can try cover up for ourselves. Let's start the mission here. Now, this mission is slightly more complicated. Okay, so what do we got here? We have a light, we have an alarm, and we have people looking outside. So, right now I can't get outside because all these people are looking at it. So, let's block off that guy's view. Let's set this guy on patrol. And this guy's already on patrol, so we can't do anything about him. But that guy is now going to be on patrol, which allows me to get access to that. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to wait until both these guys are looking the other way. Get up here, get up there, smash through that window, get access to that laptop, and jump out quickly before that guy gets here. Damn it. Okay, let's time that a bit better this time. Okay, so he's coming back now. So the second he turns around, I'm going to jump to that wall, jump through. And now we have plenty of time to get out of here. Now, there is a guard right there who will shoot us if we get access to our apartment, so we're going to need to turn him around first. So, what I'm going to do here is jump across there. And from there, I'm not entirely sure. I wonder, can we wire something from all the way over here? Oh, wow. Okay. Alright, that door is open. All we need to do now is get that guy to turn around, so let's make our way down here. And we're going to need access some stuff here, so let's open that door up. Let's go up a floor, activate this wire thing, and now we need to get access to the next one up, so we can just go up a floor, activate that wire jacker, and we still can't close that door, so all we can do here really is turn the guy around, so let's just do that. Perfect. And now we just need to get access to our apartment here. Take that. Oops. And climb up the window while the guy's not looking. Okay. Oh shoot. The optional objective, I just remembered, is to get any laptops. So let's make sure this guy isn't looking. Hmm, yeah, that's not good. Let's get this guy to turn off his light. here. Oh, I already got that laptop. Whoops. Okay, well, we can just go back to here then. Okay, well, I guess I'm more efficient than I knew. Exit in style. A plus. Gentleman ghost thoughtful. I'm amazing at this game. Okay. Now, we're covering up for ourselves, so let's say the place was clean and the only thing this guy's guilty of is great taste. Might be a dummy address. I can't find any records of who rents it. I'll keep digging and let you know what turns up. 